evening. I'm Alfred Hitchcock, here to talk about Flagler Hospital, Flagler, or whatever they call themselves now. These people are a doozy and should be laughed at every day. We have doctors that have thin skin working in the ear to pompous idiots in their psych department. Let's begin, shall we? This one is from Lawrence too. I kid you, not stolen is something I'm about to take in five minutes. This is the worst experience I've ever had a medical related business. They will make you wait then, wait again, and then wait until the point they forget about you. No empathy from anyone here. After sitting in a dark room for two hours, I made the mistake of asking what was taking too long. And they said, if you don't like it, you can leave. So I left without them helping me or prescribing anything. This place should be shut down. Avoid at all costs, oh yes, they are playing that game of I don't give a tinker's damn. Flagler is known for that one-two shuffle. Here is the top-end doctor of Flagler Hospital on time of toy. In Maud, he only has one stay because he is special. Anywho, this report is from Gina Tobler. Dr. Ward was the rudest and unprofessional doctor I've ever seen in the ear. He had a nasty bed manner and didn't even care about me as a patient. I was in such pain. I overheard him telling another doctor I thought I was faking. I would never want to be in his care again. He really doesn't need to be there. That one was a humdinger. But there is more. This one is from Marcy Fuller. Never piss off a lady with the last name Fuller, because you don't know what might come out. It was same as the other reviews. Horrible bedside manner. Rude, flippant, and uninformative. My husband was also in horrible pain, but the doc would not prescribe any pain meds. Even the nurses said he was horrible. Then the next doc came on duty and gave him pain meds right away. Just turn around and run from this guy. Those are some hurtful words, but remember the show, Good Doctor, all I got to say? You can go to War Timothy M. at 400 Health Park, Blow D, St. Augustine. Feel for more info on Google, but I must tell you my buddy 8 News has a humdinger of a story of him almost knocking this doctor out. You see, 8 News suffers from a heart problem and had two heart attacks. Mr. Big shot doctor time for a world. Just love making fun of him. And when he had chest pain, it took another doctor to get 8 News out of the room because he was going too cold cock our friend, Mr. Ward. Dr. Ward needs to be in the psych ward. That is all I have to say. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen, for stopping by. Please subscribe and like, and don't forget to swing by 8news.org for your shirts and more will be updated when I have time. Until next time, may the horror come true this Halloween.